So I recently set myself the challenge of finding the worst game on Steam. I do this on occasion just because I'm curious of what is actually at the bottom of the barrel. And when I set out for this challenge, I didn't want to just go looking for a game that was meant to be bad, because there are games like that all over the place. They're made specifically to be bad, and that can sometimes be funny, but oftentimes it's just crap for the sake of being crap. What I wanted to find was a game that had all the hope of being good, and then despite the developer's best efforts, turned out to be the worst thing ever. And there's different criteria for that. Number one, I wanted to actually cost money. I wanted to actually spend money on this so I could be disappointed by the end result. And number two, I wanted something that kind of hit on a few different topics. It wasn't just game-breakingly bad, no. I didn't want something that was super buggy, incredibly just crap. I wanted something that was actually, in the gameplay itself, terrible. And I found it. I really found it. So the first victim of my search was a game called Drug Wars, and I actually came across some interesting uh, trivia behind this one. This was a hyped up game, but if you haven't heard of Drug Wars, you wouldn't be surprised. It wasn't originally called that. It was called Merchants of Brooklyn. It came out in 2009 and was this hyped up game that some people even pre-ordered apparently, but when it came out, it was so unbelievably bad that they changed the name to try to appeal to something more. And and I couldn't even play it. So I can't judge it, because the game wouldn't even load up for me, but some of the accompanying material and gameplay footage, which you'll find here in front of you, can showcase that it's not exactly the best game in the world, but by its Steam rating of 33%, it's also not the worst. So I gave it a pass. The other game that I tried to play was called Tunnel Rats, and this was a very low-rated game on Steam, like the other one, at 34%, but this one was about the gripping reality of the Vietnam War, showcasing a side of it that didn't work. But unfortunately, after a brief opening segment, it didn't work as well. So I was left with uh, another game on my list, and I had a few more, but I don't think I needed to go any farther. This game is Skyscraper Simulator. And you'd think that this game would be cool. It looks like Euro Truck Simulator, those types of games. And, and oddly enough, this game uh, is made by someone who makes those types of games with other games like Agricultural Simulator, Industry Simulator, Agricultural Simulator 2013, Agricultural Simulator Historical Farming, which has a 12%, Farming Giant, which has a 19%, and then this game, which has the lowest score I've ever seen on Steam at a whopping 6%. And I'm sure there's lower rated games, but not many. There can't be many. Other people said things such as this. Never played it because it always crashes the desktop after the dev logo. 8 to 10 because I like my wallpaper. I love this game. My doctor gave me a prescription for Ambien to help me fall asleep, but I just fire up Skyscraper Simulator instead and save so much money on prescriptions to help me sleep. Thanks, Skyscraper Simulator! While playing, I decided to wash the dishes. It was more entertaining than playing the game. No one even drives the stupid things. One smelly Sandy out of ten, my immersion is broken. This might be my shortest review ever. This might be a game you enjoy if you enjoy watching nothing happening at various different speeds of play. Appreciate the novelty of trucks bouncing back and forth, but nothing else happens. You find 10 workers needed to drive a cement truck is feasible. Watching paint dry is your ultimate hobby. However, you shouldn't buy it if you were hoping for a fun tycoon game, you expect a more modern take of Sim Tower, you like fun. <sighs> Graphics from 1980. Hired 19,000 engineers and lost all my 25 million euros even though I couldn't see a single engineer. 19 out of 10. Lost all my money because I hired 10,000 workers when I only needed 25. 9 out of 10 would play again. I've been reserving this designation for a very special once in a lifetime game and I think this is it. Literally the worst game I've ever played. Recommending it for a once in a lifetime experience. Truly shows what it's like to be a skyscraper. Slightly less boring than staring at a wall. 3.4 hours! This was bought as a joke, but no joke, I loved it. Except it didn't start up for the first nine months, and the save button doesn't work. Getting that fine balance between delivering construction stuff and building, and wow. 20.9 hours on record. So you have to take into account, this game has a 6% rating with all of these joke thumbs up, that 
is how bad this game is. <coughs> that being said, I played it. I played through it. I went at it with positivity in my mind. I went at it without any negativity in my soul. I thought that I was going to give it an honest try, and I can honestly say... I was warned. I was warned. I really was warned. So, um, if any of you are doing anything that requires you to stay awake, I recommend that you don't watch the next few minutes of this video because it only gets more boring from here. So here is Skyscraper Simulator. Enjoy. Oh, there we go. That's good stuff. All right. Oh. Welcome to Skyscraper Simulator. This is the city view. In this view, you can buy, sell, and rent properties. Okay. Oh. Ah. Ooh. I can really see deep into the earth. I'm not sure why. I. Why is the music like that? All right, whatever. I'll go with I'll go with Baxter. I like the name Ba. Okay. What the hell? Oh, well, why isn't it shown then? Or right, whatever. I'll, I'll construe. Oh, oh, okay. Height, low on funds. Okay, well, let's not do that. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, eh? Sure. All, all, all right. Need to switch to the construction site view. Oh. Silly Samantha, Pookie Aubrey, Mammoth Samuel, Mammoth Anna, Strong Lillian, Crude Jaden, Silly Sophia, Silly Nicholas, Small Robert, Narrow Olivia. What? F page up, left, right, plus, minus. What the fucking. Okay. Uh. By Silly Samantha? Narrow Joseph? McDillon? I'm gonna go with Big Lillian. Tiny Haley? Wet Jack? Ugh. Giga Natalie? Alright. Silly Luke. Let's go with Quiet Hannah, I guess. Alright, what do we got? What do the arrows mean? Excavation stage, foundation stage, construction stage. Start. First by one excavator and one dumper. Well, I did. Signed some workers to the administration team to reduce monthly... What? Human resources. There we go. Engineers. Foreman. Workers. Foundation. Administrative. Ad administrative. Is this adding to... Are we going? Oh. Hi. Hello? Oh, oh, oh. Wow. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. What are you doing? What are you- What are you doing? Are you are- What is in there? Whoa! It's empty. Oh. Okay, administrative team. Maintenance crew. Ah, waiting for excavation. 2% done. Okay, I guess I need more excavators? Pookie Aubrey, Mammoth Samuel. Yeah, okay. Right, and then dump trucks, I guess. Soft Aiden. Okay. Strong Christopher. That's good. I'll get the others later, I guess. Okay, there's some more. They're not... Oh, there they- Oh, there they go! Oh, look at them go! There. We need more workers. As far as I'm understanding. Nope. What? Okay, that's good, I guess. Okay, more on Pookie Aubrey. Okay. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Okay. We're doing great work. I think. We're flying now. There we go. There we go. That's how you do it. Okay. When does the fun start? Oh my god. This is somehow worse than watching this happen in real time. 
This is somehow, like, if you were standing outside of a construction site and you were watching them build it, that would be more interesting than what's happening right now. Okay, I'm not gonna get critical about this game just yet, because I don't know what they're doing. Okay, hang on. Oh, wait, okay, the dumpy truckos, they don't have workers either. We don't have enough workers, we need more workers. Let's just get a bunch of workers. That sounds pretty good. I like the sound of that. I like workers. Workers are good. Workers are good. Let me see if I can snatch one of these things. There we go. Grab you. Oh, yeah. Let's crank that up. Now we should be- Oh, look at that go! I think it's better. I'm not 100% sure, but I think that's better. Is that better? Is that what you call better? Okay, and again, why can I see so deep? How- Am I gonna be digging down there? Am I gonna find some bodies buried under here? Okay, whatever. I guess I can start planning for the future, but I don't want to. Soft Samuel, get in here. Uh, Swift Samantha, Smart Alexa. There you go. I don't know why we did that. I've got plenty of money. I mean, money doesn't seem to be a big issue in this endeavor. If I knew it was this easy to build a skyscraper, I would have done it myself a long time ago. Okay, I think... We- we're getting close to done with excavation, which is great, right? BOOM! DONE! Wahoo! Why'd we pause? Okay, where did that come from? Did that descend from the heavens and just smash right into there? Get more workers in here. Foundation is underway. I don't know what they're doing. Oh, you're filling it back in- WE JUST DUG THAT OUT! WE JUST- WE JUST- Dug that out, didn't we? Alright, I don't know. I guess there's- I guess that's supposed to be cement, but it, I just feel like all the hard work that I just did is now been laid away. I feel like you're just kind of like mocking me now. Isn't- is there some way to see like my actual- oh, I see. Okay, here we go. Okay, I gotcha. So I can see- yeah, 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 yeah. One, two, three. There we go. Okay, yeah, we're- yeah, we're, we're- we're gonna be going now. Does it- Take away- good! It takes away the other workers, so I can just crank these up to maximum, right? Why is your performance awful, crude Christian? What is it? Screw you, crude Christian! Give me a better one. Tiny Jacob? Yeah, Tiny Jacob, get in here. I don't know, is there any punishment for actually hiring this many things? I have no idea. Okay, there we go. I don't know what we did. What are we doing? What are we doing? Oh! But what does that even mean? You're just raising up this big weird obelisk that appeared out of the sky. What is that? Okay, whatever. I guess we're almost done. And then we're halfway through the finishing the building? Is that what I'm supposed to- Is that what I'm understanding about this? We're halfway done. Oh. Great. Wait, is that it? Wait, is that- Wait, is this the whole thing? But then why did we- Why did we dig that hole? Also, what did you f what? Oh, there- there you go. Alright, let's fill them up, I guess. Trying to fill up some more... workers, I guess. We're not building. Why are we not building? What- what do- what do, what do we need? Waiting on what? Waiting on- waiting on what? What do we need? You're not telling me what we need, you, it's just glowing red! Job... Steel skeleton- oh. Is that- what we're supposed to- Ah! Uh, oh my god, this is the whole game. Oh my god, this is the whole game. <sighs> okay. I don't know what I'm supposed to do besides wait here. I, uh, I'm tr- I'm honestly- I'm trying to find what it is I'm supposed to be doing. There must be some nascent satisfaction factor to this concept, right? Th there- there has to be, right? There would have to be. Would anyone play this game in normal speed? If you're playing this game in normal speed, 
It's already been one year, 44 weeks, three days on the dot. Every hour is one second. So if I bust down my calculator here. All the time that we just spent here, if you were playing this in normal speed, you'd be sitting here for four and a half hours. I'm gonna just play on fast. I still don't understand why we dug that gigantic hole for this building. I feel like I'm also not playing the game right because I probably hired way too many workers and I probably haven't been tossing them around efficiently between machines. I haven't been buying the right machines, but I've still got 14 million euros. And if I am playing it wrong, then you would have to play this a lot more slowly because you wouldn't have as many workers working on your skyscraper and therefore it would take longer. There's nothing else for me to do at this point. I'm literally just sitting around. I mean, I want to see it done. I want to see it done. I'm hoping that there's going to be some kind of a satisfaction out of it. I mean, maybe you could multitask and do other projects at once, but I don't think I have the money for it, I guess. And we're really- we're moving fast now, and that's good! This is the most direct equivalent to watching paint dry I've ever seen in a game. And I'm not trying to say that, like, I'm not coming at this game trying to be insulting about it. I mean, look at what paint drying is. You look at a wall and you wait and watch as minute changes happen over a long period of time. And compare that to what I'm doing in this game. Done. Took two years, 17 weeks, and 16 hours. All right. What now? So there's no management system of rent or... Ah, there... It's just plus or minus again. So... What... Do... Is... Am I making money? Am I'm not, I did I'm I am. I made money. Okay. So I guess the next thing to do would be to build another one. Oh. But that's too expensive. I can't I don't have enough money. I have to wait until I get money. Huh. Okay. Alright, I think I'm good. I think I, I think I think I'm good. Leaderboard. No one's on the leaderboard. Okay. I'm good. I'm real good. So that was arguably the worst game on Steam, and I say that not from broken controls because. Oddly enough, the controls worked, not from glitchy gameplay, because at the end of it, I did build a skyscraper, and I guess it was a simulation of what it's like to be a skyscraper, but at the same time, it wasn't fun, it wasn't a happy time, I had no idea why I was even there, and frankly, I'm sad that I wasted my life trying to figure out why they dug that big of a hole for that small of a skyscraper. But either way, that is... The worst game that I found on Steam. I'm sure that I'll find another because I'm sure that you guys know about worst games on Steam. So if you know of a game that's worse than this one, let me know down in the comments below. I will go through the process of reviewing it myself and I will show you how probably right you are. So thank you everybody so much for watching and as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye bye!